Hey everyone, Pupsker here, and today in Warframe, I wanted to go over how we can farm every single new Tenokai Melee mod in the game. If you don't know what Tenokai Melee is, it is the brand new Melee mod stance, essentially, brought to Warframe. It's not like a stance, it's its own mod thing. It is a Melee Tenokai mod, it goes in this section right here, and there are, I think, this many of them, like five or six. You also have regular melee um, mods that could go up there, but you wouldn't want things like focus, defense, parry, right? You wouldn't want dispatch, overdrive. You want the Tenokai mods, right? It says Tenokai, 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 Tenokai. So these are all five of the Tenokai mods, and we'll quickly go over how to farm them. All in all, it's fairly simple. You have to complete the Whispers in the Wall questline to unlock everything, essentially meaning you have to be fully caught up in the game, and you can farm them on one simple map. It is the Alchemy game mode in Deimos, the new Deimos Sanctum Anatomica Cam Buyer Alchemy game mode. The drop rates are as follows for rotation C. So you have to do four total rounds of alchemy in order to farm these. It is a mandatory C drop rotation without any sort of guaranteed pity. This is the only way you can get these five Tenokai mods outside of just buying them from the market. You know, you know that's why they're fully C drop rotations. So you have uncommon, uncommon, uncommon. These are three of the Tenokai mods at a 12% drop rate. And then you have the Discipline's Merit and Dreamer's Wrath as 6% alchemy drop rates. Now, that's just kind of how it goes. Nothing we can do around that. This new map will probably be a good spot for people to farm the new mods. Platinum, sell the uh, mods to people for some platinum, but the mods are pretty cheap overall. So let's run the alchemy mission, talk about how to actually run the alchemy mission, and then we'll be good to go. Because some people have been asking me, how do I run the, the alchemy mission? It's pretty simple and straightforward. You have to match the alchemy elements that it says, and then you just straight up are good to go essentially from there. You match the alchemy, and then it turns into a volatile mission. Okay, so you can see they've already started. I picked up a cold, like a frost alchemy thing, and you have to throw them at this big alchemy thingy thing right there. So that's all you do, is you kill enemies, and then you pick up the elements, so this is cold and electricity. So you pick that up and throw them there. Pick it up with X, throw it with middle mouse button. It's like the usual pick up and throw mechanics for anything. So we have to fill up the Crucible to 100%. Now I'm just going here for like a quick A drop rotation, just a very fast one. You see this fire one? Don't need it. Throw it at the enemies, didn't mean to pick that up. And that's how you quickly run Alchemy. It gets a little longer and more annoying if you have more people, and I think the longer you go on, I think legitimately the A drop rotation is the fastest. If you don't know what Tenokai is, by the way, it's whenever you're mailing, you get that little symbol in the middle. That means you get a free heavy attack that doesn't cost anything. I just wanted to wait until I was actually fighting people to show it off. Right? Like, nothing yet, nothing yet, nothing yet. I showed off, like, one Tenokai attack so far, I think. Yeah, see? There you go. That's the Tenokai attack. It's when that little sword pops up in the middle, and then you attack. So now that we got it maxed out, it turns into a, a volatile. What you want to do in that top left is keep the pressure within that middle thing, right? I will go with this person. So shoot it when it's about 75%, and then that will keep the entire conversion process going. And that's essentially the whole mission, right? That is how you play alchemy missions, and that is how you farm Tenokai mods. But again, you have to go to C drop rotation, so that'll be every four crucibles complete will be a full C drop rotation, right? The, the drop rotation goes A, A, B, C. And that is how you farm all of the Tenokai mods in the game. I'm going to leave now, but for Tenokai, right? And that is all. So hopefully this guide helps. If it did, remember to subscribe, like, use Epic Games creator code Pupsker, check out the Twitch stream over at twitch.tv slash Pupsker, or any of the other socials. I, of course, am going to continue on grabbing my Vokas, and then I will run to the mission and complete it. So, yeah, hope that helped. Cheers, cheers.